Hello everyone, welcome to the Engineering Projects YouTube channel. In the previous video tutorial, we have implemented Metron Exporter in ASPMDC tutorial project, which is here. And now, in this video tutorial, we are going to plan to develop the admin panel for our tutorial project. As I have already explained you that we are going to use Metronics for the admin panel and uh, in the previous video tutorial we are working with existing application features but now we will develop the whole new controller and views to separate the admin panel from existing features so stop the execution of the application and go to the controller add a new controller controller and name it as admin so it will create the admin controller okay so here is the admin controller the first view will be the dashboard so its name will be dashboard save it right click here add view and it will be empty and we will use the default layout okay which is going on now uh, we need to use this layout and from here we will execute this application and it will show us the empty page having uh, only text dashboard Within this, we can implement our whole theme without any other error. Okay, so this is the theme right now. Okay, so we we have two layouts. The this is the old layout and this is the new layout. So we will copy this code into the new layout and use that here. Okay, so we need to stop execution go to the shared okay add and uh, new item and from here you can search layout okay so here we have uh, the layout view page with layout or we can have only layout this okay I will see I will say the metronics layout and hit enter okay <coughs> content folder yes oops no we need to add here okay so here we have the metronics layout okay uh, close everything which we don't need admin controller needed okay this now oops okay we have created the view instead of the layout so we need to delete this and create only the layout this okay so it's here now what we need to do we need to copy all the essential things from here to here okay so now it will not disturb our application also we need to copy this page wrapper and body tag oh like this what we have oops not this simply this what we have right now okay 
uh, it also contain the footer had resend it here and here is the footer so we will copy this and paste right here now we will execute our dashboard all the content within this page will be execute under the body render okay so here we are going to view our dashboard admin having dashboard so it is executed here okay now we need to declare that we want to use a specific layout okay uh, whenever you want to use a specific layout you need to declare that uh, so you need to declare that here that you want to use a specific layout for that uh, what we will do uh, here we will say we want to use layout which is which is something like views shared under the name which is oops which is this okay so that's enough and now we will refresh the page okay so now it's working okay so now it's working in the next video tutorial we will implement all other things i hope this video is informative if you have any kind of question you can ask us and don't forget to subscribe the engineering projects youtube channel take care bye bye have fun